Hey guys, it's Shannon. And Paul and Stein. Paul and Stein. Yeah, Paul. All right. It's Shannon Stein and Paul and Stein. That's right. We're Paul from the Black Lagoon. Ooh. All right. Today we are going to be opening up the Universal Monsters blind box figures from Pockmart, and they look super awesome. It's actually called the Universal Monsters Alliance. Ooh, I like it. So, Paul... Do you want to show us what monsters we can find? Absolutely. Okay, so you can get the classic Universal Monsters. Frankenstein, Bride of Frankenstein, Van Helsing, Creature from the Black Lagoon. Um, this is Phantom of the Opera, Invisible Man, The Mummy, Dracula, and The Wolfman. And there is a secret. I we, really want the secret. We are really hoping to find the secret. Yes. Okay, these are incredible figures. We have opened these before over on Collector Corner. We're opening them again because we're trying to find this secret. And if you haven't seen these yet, you are in for a treat. That is correct. All right. If I don't find the secret, I would like to find Van Helsing. For, I have my reasons. <laughs> ah, okay. Started off with um, my guy, the creature from the Black Lagoon. This is an awesome figure. The paint job on him is more glossy yeah um so it looks like he has like a coat of slime or water on him this this outfit is really cool like obviously this is the classic look he's like a sickly algae green <laughs> color and then with these yellow huge gills and fins um doesn't look streamlined at all almost has like a duck bill face and like sunken beady eyes and he has his little movie snack his little uh tin of fish here that he can munch on the movie chairs are incredible. They all say the the monster's name on the back. Creature from the Black Lagoon, February 12th, 1954. And then his feet are like in a little puddle. I don't remember when we opened these before. He On his card, he's holding a little fish. A little sardine. Oh yeah, he sure is. Does his hand look like it can actually hold one? Because usually they don't show that, but I don't see a fish in here. It looks like it's possible that he could hold one, but yeah, I don't see one. Maybe... I don't know. I tipped this upside down into our trash can, but usually they would come in little plastic bags. Yeah, usually they would. So... I don't remember one. I don't remember one either, but now that's going to bother me. Anyway, they okay. showed him there with a the fish, but maybe that's just for the artwork because he's actually eating his snack. Maybe. Oh. Yeah, the mummy... The mummy also has something in his hand, but I think that that's just molded on. Maybe they forgot to mold it? Maybe. Ah, there the mummy. Go. The mummy. Yes, so he is eating a box of chicken nuggets. <laughs> Pretty funny. I like the little ring he's wearing. He's really, really cool. I think I said this in the other video. He does not look like the you know mummies that I'm familiar with. He's much darker. Yes. Which is pretty cool and I love his like bloodshot kind of eyes. Yeah. So they each come with their little movie theater chair as they're watching their special movie. The Mummy came out December 22nd, 1932. It's amazing how old some of these movies are and oh, how they're just so classic and loved. I mean, that's almost 100 years old. Yeah. The mummy. As opposed to the daddy. Yes. Well, the mummy is very important. Probably more so than the daddy. <laughs> ah! <laughs> I have the wolf man. So this would be me. <laughs> he's all scrunched up how he's sitting, and I, I sit that way sometimes. He also has a big bag of potato chips that he's munching through. And he's holding a little potato chip in that finger, or in that hand. And there he is. He sits on his chair without his feet on the ground, just like perched on the edge of his seat. The Wolfman, December 12th, 1941. Yeah, that would be me. <laughs> Very cool. All right, so there is your card. Now, that Black Lagoon guy either came with a fish that we missed or they did not put the fish in his hand. It's 
Yeah. Because I looked up our video, and our other video, he has a fish in his uh, hand. Oh, he sure does. So. So, yeah, it, it, could have, it could have broken off in transit. Or um, just never got put in his hand? Yeah, because I, f- I feel like it's very much like the chicken nugget, the potato chip. I don't feel like it was a separate piece. Yeah, I, I don't, could be wrong about that. I don't think it was either, but I'd have to watch the video to see. I just saw a screenshot. Yeah. Um, so, anyway, just yep. so you know. Aha, we have Van Helsing. Yep, Van Helsing. Okay, now he does come with accessories yes. that are not pre-put into his hands. Yes, but we will not be putting one into his hands. <laughs> so, here he is. He's wearing an awesome outfit. I like his hat and coat. and The color of his pants are really cool, too. They're, like, gray and, I don't know, they look like stone because there's multiple different colors of gray. It's like they are stone-washed jeans. Van Helsing, May 6, 2004. A much more recent movie, even yep. though it's almost 20 years old. That's <laughs> incredible <laughs> to think about that. He comes with two accessories that he can hold. Yep. He has a little crossbow. Yep, a little crossbow. And a little oh, root beer yeah, mug. Yeah, root beer mug. So, very cute. We are going to set him there. We are going to set his accessories next to him. Yep. I imagine he doesn't just watch the movie and yell at the screen. He has a crossbow at the ready. Yes. He'll shoot the monster on the screen. <laughs> That'd be funny. Oh, I have the Invisible Man. Who's not so invisible. Yep. Oh, I didn't notice this the first time we... Okay, so here he is. He is wearing gloves, so his hands are visible. His face is completely wrapped. His mouth is completely open. Like Yeah, you I'd, can put something in there. Yeah, I did not realize that. Here, check it out. book in there. Yeah, check it out. <laughs> his book's gone. He ate a book for a second. He did eat a book. So he is awesome. He comes with this little book accessory i'll show you how that works here he is uh oh i i i I love his little hat it's like the walter white hat um there's his chair the invisible man november 13th 1933 he also comes with a little soda he did not opt for the value size And so his book sits right here on the arm of his chair, and then he just rests his hand on it. Yep. That's pretty cool. That is cool. It's like, this is my journal. I like Gotta that. love a good journaler. Yeah. Heisenberg. That's it from, from Breaking Bad. <laughs> was that bothering you? It was, yes. Oh, the Bride of Frankenstein. She has... I don't know what she's eating. I say a cheese puff. Cheese balls. Yeah. That's cheese balls. Sure. <laughs> or a cheese puff. Uh, Bride of Frankenstein, April 22nd, 1935. I love the way she's sitting. She's just so ladylike. Yes. She's kind of sitting here. Kind of off to the side. She has her knees off to the side. Her dress pull, is pulling around her feet, and she has her arm up like, "Oh, darling, do tell." <laughs> she's munching on her cheese puffs. Yep. All right, there's her card. She's probably telling him, like, "Put the crossbow down. <laughs> Just enjoy the movie and relax." Maybe don't listen to her, Van Helsing. <laughs> you, you hold your crossbow if you want to. Dracula. Ha ha ha. There's Dracula. I think I think he is the original monster. I think he's the first one. So, very cool. Blah, he, blah, blah. Yeah, he yeah. has his long cape with the huge collar. Black on the outside, red on the inside. He is, like, leaned on his elbow, or his elbow's on the arm of the chair, leaning on his fist, like, I am just so bored. I have seen all these movies before. <laughs> Hollywood can't come up with anything original. Everything's a sequel. <laughs> and his snack is a 
nice glass of mommy juice. <laughs> Only made from the freshest mommies. <laughs> His chair, Dracula, February 12th, 1931. He's fun. He is fun. And this is going to be the last one for me. Who are we missing? We're missing Obviously, the... the secret. Yeah, Frankenstein. And Phantom. Frankenstein and Phantom, yes. Okay. Well, I hope I get Frankenstein to sit over here with the Bride of Frankenstein. Let's see. Oh, I have Phantom. Phantom. Phantom of the Opera, unmasked. Yes. Oh, does he not have a snack? Yes, you almost threw a... St he uh, has an accessory. Yep. Okay. Technically, it's not a snack unless he wants to eat roses. But if he was a deer, he could eat the roses. He has a rose. Here he is mas unmasked and then masked. He has a little mask. Yep. That's so awesome. Ta-da! Oh, I really like him. He's cool. This mask fits really good. He's also wearing a big puffy shirt. He is wearing a big puffy shirt. He's a comfy monster. He's like the original pirate. The yes. big puffy pirate shirt. The dread pirate. So pirates. there he is. I just feel so much love. I'm going to eat a rose. <laughs> There's his card. He's, I think he's the only monster that movie came out in summer. Oh, I didn't say when his movie came out. August 27th, 1943. All right, last but not least, I know who we have based on the accessories. We have Frankenstein. He is absolutely incredible. I love his green jacket. It's like also acid washed or something, so it's not just flat green. Um, his pants are cool, they're orange. He has the big shoes on. I like how thin his little legs are. He's wearing skinny jeans. He has the best food snack. Yep, he has a little pumpkin. Full of cheese balls. So, oh, that's yeah. That's what she's eating. Yep, that's what she's eating. She's eat. sharing. I didn't notice that. I didn't either. Last time. He also has a brain accessory. <laughs> and then his hair just pops on. Cool. That's pretty good. He never has a bad hair day. That is true. So you can just put it on. When did his movie come out? Frankenstein, November 21st, 1931. Ah. A lot of these movies came out around Christmas time. Yeah. A lot in November, too. Okay, yeah. so Frankenstein. Now we have to pick favorites. Yes. So I wanna, I'm want i going to make a rule here. Okay. Um, we're not going to pick Frankenstein. We're not going to pick the people we picked as favorites last time. Is that who I picked? You picked Frank. Are you sure? I'm pretty sure. Okay. I think I remember that, yeah. Okay. Frankenstein and Bride of Frankenstein are the obvious choices for us, because that's you and I. Okay. I'm going with Dracula. Dracula. Oh, that's yes. a good pick. He just looks so above it all. He does. <laughs> He's pretty awesome. I think I'm gonna pick. I'm gonna pick the mummy this time around. Ah, I like is it, it because of the chicken fingers? It is. It is actually. <laughs> I like the snack. I also like that he has that cool ring. How about you guys? Which one of these did you like the best? Leave a comment down below. Let us know. Leave the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Hit the share button. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. It's gonna make you part of the PS Toy Reviews crew. Where if you try and put Van Helsing's root beer mug in his hand, the handle might break. And don't go to the movies without your fish snack. Mm. People beside you will really enjoy that. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.